What is up guys, The Fighting Therapist here and we're in Dubai again for another fight. This time for a very interesting fight with two very different athletes. Devin Larratt right here, which is the guy that I'm actually cornering. I've been helping train pretty much for the last two to three weeks. And then we have the guy he's fighting, which is half Thor Bjornsson. I really hope I didn't butcher that, but the guy from Game of Thrones, The Mountain. Um, Eddie Hall, which is a, a strongman powerlifter. He was supposed to fight half Thor and um, actually this Saturday, but he actually tore his bicep and needed surgery. So Devin Larratt decided to take over and fill in in a short week's notice. He came to Montreal, Canada and um, got about only three to four guys that I actually spar with him and I was one of them. So even though there's a massive weight difference <laughs> between me and him, but we were back here and I thought it would be great to try to capture as much footage as I can, show you guys kind of what's going on. There is a massive amount of huge people here. I mean, like just in size, I so puny <laughs> compared to all these guys and uh, trying to get a couple of those guys on here so we could actually discuss like training, training tactics, uh, injury prevention strategies. I think it'd be really cool for you guys to kind of see what's going on as well as see how the training is going for Devin. With that said, I'm just going to finish my greens and then head downstairs for all you can eat breakfast. I'll show you guys what we're starting the day with. I, I doubt it's gonna be anywhere near as much as Devin, but <laughs> let's see how that goes. Zach's having a nightmare and he's like fighting an imaginary person. <laughs> I wouldn't want to fight him. No. <laughs> two guys are. I'm, I'm six foot there. two and Devin <laughs> is going in as the short guy. It's, it's, it's crazy. It's, <laughs> <laughs> Everyone see, that sees me in real life, I'm not touring in real life because yeah, yeah. they used to see me again yeah. around giant guys. <laughs> Devin's making you look small again. No. How was today? Amazing, incredible. Yeah. I feel better than ever. You ready, 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 ready? Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> so, the only I'm, thing that story said today was my nose. That's it. My that's nose it. is the most sore. Like as soon as I go like this, ah, <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna sneeze, and my nose starts running, and yeah, boxing. Honestly, I I hope it does. I hope it feels better by the time I fight. But at the same time, I hope it bleeds a ton. It looks good for you. Yeah, I want, want it, I want blood to be everywhere. Like, <laughs> that'd be incredible, yeah. I just don't want it to hurt. That, that part sucks. Uh, you're incredible, man. This guy is the best, I'm telling you. Smart. We're gonna have fun. Smart We're gonna guy. have fun. We're gonna have fun. We're gonna have fun. We're back in the hotel room. Pretty much training one. He's still kind of tired. He's still kind of jet lagged, so. There's no reason to kind of push it for today. There's absolutely not even one besides just getting a good sweat, kind of working more some technical stuff, some agility stuff, some more kind of strategy for next Saturday. That's pretty much what today, that, that whole goal was about for about an hour of a workout. Probably gonna do a nap. Um, I actually might be working, but Devin's gonna do a nap because we kind of want to simulate as much as possible the fight. He's going to be fighting at midnight, so we want him to be pretty much taking a nap in the middle of the day so that he's just ready to go but right now. I'm gonna head down, Devin's waiting for me right now, and uh, grab meal number two. All right guys, we're done, the pool workout. How was it? That was awesome. I, I just, I, I got some old damaged body parts, but uh, the pool is probably the most gentle way that we can kind of get everything working. Yeah. yeah. Felt our, good. Our whole plan for Devin is to 
accumulate a lot of volume, but that's non-fatiguing and also adding a recovery kind of modality to it. And that's why we went with the water. Hey, 46 years old and I'm still learning new ways to work out. <laughs> yeah, and I'm terrified of cold water. And swimming pools in Dubai, that is the way to go. Yes. Seriously, that is the best, the best thing possible. Yeah, because today hit 55 degrees or feels like 55. And we were sweating a lot. Yeah, Slugman Gander. <laughs> yeah. 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 Right now we're gonna relax. We're actually going to get food for dinner and then uh, chill. Then we have another game plan for tomorrow. But uh, that's it. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Okay. All right guys, we're back in the room. Great first day. And I hope you guys did enjoy day one. So make sure that you like, subscribe, and click that notification bell so you guys do know when every single one of these videos do come up. They're gonna be posted leading up all the way to the fight, which is going to be next Saturday, so don't forget to tune in on that. Uh, when I get the links, I will add them in the description so you guys can kind of go click it, and check it out, and uh, watch the fight. Going to be very interesting card, a very interesting fight, two very interesting different type of athletes, and um, I'm excited to see it, even if I'm on one side of the team. So I still think it's going to be a really uh, nice spectacle for all you guys to watch while also at the same time bringing a lot of fans from different fields in to watch this fight. You know, you got the strongman section, power lifters, you have some CrossFit athletes, you have some CrossFit stuff, you got the arm wrestling community, and then you also have some of the actual boxers that are on the car, so you have some boxing fans as well. So it's a really nice mix to bring all those sports together and all those fan bases and kind of just make a nice show. But it's the Fighting Therapist here. I will catch you guys tomorrow and uh, have yourself a good night. Ciao.